Well, I don't know if you can see or not, but uh, it's a bit of a it's a bit of a day up here in the hills, and I've come up to give a bit of a uh, bit of extra feed here, a bit of extra haylage silage on the floor of these cattle up here, and uh, they're feeling the weather. I don't know if you can see around, but there's clouds over there, and there's snow in that, and there's a pretty uh, pretty interesting cold easterly wind uh, coming in here, and it's uh, giving us a bit of jip. But I'm up here, and I've got my uh, I got my kaiwaka jacket on best New Zealand kit and uh, we try and be properly dressed for the environment otherwise you get up here you get in trouble and somebody else has got to come up and bail you out and that's no good at all but uh, certainly there's this old saying that says uh, there's no such thing as bad weather there's just inappropriate clothing you don't want to be up here on a day like today with inappropriate clothing and if I just pan around a bit I can show you over there there's the Brecon Beacons out there bit of a shout out to the Brecon Beacons Mountain Rescue Boys both lots of rescue people in bad weather with inappropriate clothing all the time I know their patience puts up with it I really I really don't know because you know judgment day up here when it comes down on you up here this judgment day you really don't want to be found found wanting and uh, you don't want to be the person with the inappropriate clothing on a day like that it just puts me in mind of a verse in the Bible in Hebrews 9 verse 27 that says it is given to man wants to die and then face judgment up here you face judgment day and if you haven't got the right kit on you, you're gonna die up here of exposure or something horrible happening to you frostbite it feels like today it's really quite uh, that wind is is really quite a cracker and i can see snow over there this is going to be a short video because i'm going to be back down there in a minute with a nice cup of tea if you're caught out with inappropriate clothing up here it's judgment day and you could die but the verse in the bible says you die and then you face judgment. We don't want to, any of us want to think about any of that, but it is good to be warned. And nobody's going to argue with the Mountain Rescue Boys when they put all that good stuff on Facebook and Twitter, telling us what they've been doing, warning us that we don't want to be caught out with inappropriate clothing on Judgment Day. Guys, here's a challenge. Are you ready to sort yourself out for the Judgment Day that's coming on all of us? Not up here in the cold in these hills, not one you can get out of by going for a nice warm cup of tea down at, down at the bottom there in the farmhouse again. But the one that comes because we're all accountable for what we do. We're all accountable for what we do. We're all responsible for our actions. Not just in these hills, but in the whole of our life. And we will need to be clothed with Christ's righteousness, having turned from sin, trusted him to put us right with God on the day that it comes upon us. Okay, that's a sober one, it's a sombre one, but it's important to be sober and sombre about safety in the hills, as it is to be sober and sombre about our eternal destiny.